Ninja Twist, same mount. Ninja Twist starts with um, couch. Couch. I'm sorry, an armpit couch. I call this armpit couch. It's just hanging up, right? So this is also known as cross. From here, she's going to grab her own hands together. Oh. Okay. Right? That gives you an ability to stay tighter. Okay. Um, remember the fall that can happen again is most side to side. Her limit knees. And have her bring her feet down first. And she's bound. Anytime you're bound as a flyer, let go of that bind when you're falling, okay? Very good. Okay. The common thing is it flies and bring the hips off. Keep your sacrum on the basis knees. They'll allow you to balance easier, okay? So bring her legs tucked in. Okay, here's the sometimes tricky part. Where do I put my feet? Where do I put my hands? For me, I like to guide um, the fly by grabbing one foot. For, for this time, I'm gonna grab my right side here, which is her left foot. The important thing to remember is right, left, you'll, you'll forget it. You just need to know it needs to be across. You need to cross your arms and your feet. So if, her, if I'm grabbing this foot, she's gonna grab it with this hand, okay? We're gonna bend the knee. We're tucked here for a sec. I'm gonna ask her to, to one thing I can do to cue when, if I say right or left, sometimes it's hard for a fly to understand. I just, I just uh, tact, tactically cue. I, I shake my foot. Okay, grab this hand, and then grab, take this hand, grab this foot. So she takes it, she bends the knee, she grabs it like that. Okay? And then same thing, I'm gonna say, okay, take this hand, I'm shaking with my foot, and grab this foot. So she's just in like a kind of cross-legged position for here. So get to here first. Okay, this can be more pressure on the foot there. You can alleviate that by bending your knee a bit there. So more of her weight is actually on your knee like this, okay? So while you're here, now we're gonna go into, get here first, we're gonna now go into the ninja kick position. And in the ninja kick position, you'll sometimes be confusing which leg do you bend, which leg do you straighten. So for me, one uh, mnemonic I try to remember is um, the top straightens, the bottom bends. Just the bottom bends is like an alliteration you can remember. So her leg right now, this leg's on top. You see that? Mm -hmm. So she's going to hold on to her, um, try to reach for your cat there. There. She's going to straighten this leg, the top leg, straighten it out that way. Her bottom leg is still bent. So now we're slowly getting to that ninja kick position, right? So straight, top straightens, bottom bends. Now here's the part that we did earlier about using your arms to take weight. I'm going to grab her hip bone on the side right there. So I'm going to slowly tilt her this way. I'm bending this knee, tilting her this way. Now I have all her weight is stacked on top of this hip bone here. I'm going to place my right hand on it this way, pushing it up. It's a lot of weight. So I'll take my other hand, place it also on top. Because this leg is straight, be mindful she can fall this way, right? And because you're bound, flyers, unbind your hand if you fall this way. Uh, once you have this weight here, you can start straightening this leg and then stacking this hand also and pushing it straight up like this. So now that you're creating a nice ninja looking position, it looks like a kicking out like a ninja. So I'm grabbing her leg and pushing it back up like that. Doing a ninja <laughs> twist. Yeah. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> no sound! <laughs> Let's demo again. Okay. Quickly. Okay. Yes. Okay. Over. And if we're lucky, we'll get a sound from that. Here. <laughs> it doesn't matter which leg's over. You just need to remember top straightens and bottom bends, okay? So why don't we take this arm, Magda, and grab this leg? And take this arm and grab that leg. She'll straighten the top leg, and she'll keep the bottom leg bent. I'm going to shift the bottom hip, push it up. And I can help with that by, if I bend this right leg, it'll shift it this way. But be mindful, she might fall that way, okay? So I'll bend, push it up, and then straighten my leg. As I'm pushing up, my arms are stacked. And I can push back up that way. And you can turn around again, right? <laughs> <laughs> and remember, just play with the weight, and if you feel like 
Um, the weight's too much towards your head. Bring it back a little. And place, play with the hand place. Maybe you need it more towards the knee you can up there. But I find the deepest twist is towards the hip there. Because eventually you can push up there and then take one hand away. You feel comfortable and start doing that. You can create interesting lines with your arms and your legs. But for now, both hands there. Okay, one more time and really quickly. See how fast we can become a ninja. Okay, one, armpits, in, up, grabbing the foot, grabbing the foot, twisting, straightening the leg, the bottom bends. Alright, questions. Clarification. Give it a try. Let's go.